Yes. Got him. Seven out of eight? Look at that. It's already happening. Here, I'll move this for you. That was for you. Really? I thought it was directly in your view. No, not really. Oh, okay. Here, I'll put it back then. Because it's literally not in mine. I can see everything on the I screen. I can see all the cards. Okay, you know what? Your monitor is insanely large. It's all, That's what she said. <laughs> I think it's this guy. Okay. Should we do a Michael stipulation where Michael takes all the cards, takes all, makes all the picks? I think he wants me to take... We're take a fun card. It's it's not going to be... More, that's boring ass. Your most boring ass card. What do you want to take, Michael? Like let's win. let's talk into the yeah, microphone. I'll, I'll just if you're attacked by your microphone, I don't like it. It doesn't like you either. Shits. Oh, they got the the arts. Yeah, for borders. the arts, the borders. This is the old one, you know. Man, this Nick sets Nixon, which is weird because it already had no Nixon in it. But... Yes, the reason I assume is oh, because of the no no lady. Yep, now I understand. MTGO suggested Shriek Maw. Yeah, that's what we should have went with. Has anyone ever beaten Coma in Game of Magic the Gathering? You got cast. You got you got cast it though. You got to actually pay seven mana. You know. Metalwork. Over, Over Metalworker. Yeah. This is why we can't trust him. I feel like the artifact deck doesn't. Oh. Oh, cool. That's awesome. Okay, okay. Yeah, I just saw a notification, a tweet by Magic Online, and they were like, let's see the, the tweet. We've never been able to run our game successfully. Thank you for your patience. Our fix did not succeed, and we will not be able to address it until Monday morning. In the meantime, Vintage Cube, Constructed, Casual, and, and uh, March of the Machine draft are available. All Mom Sealed is paused until we can get a fix. Oh, Mom. Oh, Mom. This is an artifact. That, this makes an artifact. That one's a better pick, I think. That's a combo piece. Right? Holds like every magic card ever. Every magic card ever. You swallow like Commander Cooper. Man. I like Agent here. It's a good outlet sword. What's it called? It's a good. Hey man, at least I got a rabbit from it. Yeah. I'll take Agent. Mike's Mike isn't miking. That doesn't sound Are correct. Sure? Yeah, for some reason uh, it's. Oh. Wonderful. How about and now? You were the last time. You adjusted the last. I was the last time. It's all your fault. Let the court be witness. I moved it, and then you literally stopped me and said, "I'll do it," and then you moved it. Yeah, but I did the. I like just moved it so mm -hmm. I could sit. Fascinating. We'll play back the videotape. None of this is gonna hold <laughs> up in court, just so you know. I like a mull drifter. I like a a winter orb. No, I don't. That's the Michael Winter Orb hand. Is it? Is it? It's good. One more drifter, I think. I like Rona. You ever get the Rona? Sometimes. You ain't never had the Rona. Don't lie. No, I actually never have. I don't know why. I'm just like that. I don't know. I had two other bad ones. I just never had the Rona. Oh man, I guess it's consider here. That's pretty good. Are we metalworking? I don't even know. Guess the world will never know. Is top as good as considering you just take it as an artifact? I hate this card and I don't want to play with it or against it because it's just not fun. It's got to be faster. Mm, Preordain. We're just taking all the can trips. Look at that. That's an artifact and it's a fat daddy. Wish this was an artifact. It'd be if you target it with Oh, some <laughs> smart. What's that? I two mana rock that. that makes things artifact. Silver, something or other. Quick silver. I don't know. It's a two mana tap for one. Make him stop. Make Somebody artifact. please. Somebody please. Oh, mind twist. That's a late mind twist. And we got Mox Jet. Beautiful. Just you might say. I oh the, look look your first pick came back. Everybody's coming up Millhouse. Oh, factor fiction. This is also interesting because there's a Splinter Twin going around. I want to let someone have the the perfect twin deck. Hmm. 
You want a dark confidant in this deck? We got a bunch of cheapies. I'm going to take it. It's not a coward stream. Wow. Someone's getting lucky. Someone's getting lucky tonight, boys. I don't think Jar does anything. I would just take Fatal Push and play it. Because it's a playable card. Well, there's nothing to twin either, so. Yeah, yeah, but you stop them from the twin, you know? Who? Do, who stop who? I guess Fatal Push literally. Also. No, no, it doesn't. I mean, yeah, it does if, you, if you're able to revolt. Yeah, but who's to say that's going to happen, you know? Oh, my God, dude. It's a league. You're not even going to play against the people in your pod. My last draft, I played against two players out of Black Lotus. Seems good for them. <laughs> it was. I still won, but it was... They liked it. Yes, I was actually really hoping that came back. You can't use all the colors. Still seems good. It's taps for five mana. You ever, you ever spent I five mana on anything? Oh, Brain Geyser, huh? Definitely not. I did not recognize. Yeah. She's very happy, though. I'm going to take this Force of Will. I guess you've, you forced me into it. Into what? What, what, what was what? What did you, what did you get forced? Okay. I'm in a lot of pain right now, thanks to my gooby. What is this? Oh my god, this is one of Katie's little strings from her, from her cross stitch underground sea. He's gave me his life. Frexian Revoker. Oh, we got we got Walking Burlista. Walking Burlista. You got one of my favorite cards in the pack. Is it the barista? It's the king. Yeah, I know. Old Kenny boy. Not really castable for us, though. So. You don't think so? We got a Timeless Lotus right here, bro. It's true. Titan will come back. Sundry Titan. I'm going to take Walking Ballista. It does all the things we want. Oh, I missed the Confluence. Oh, man, I have such a hard time doing the thing. Stip bits. Let's run back a classic ladies looking left. Do your best to pick them, but if you need to override for... Wait, ladies look... So, so what is this step? Eric, what is this? Ladies looking to the left. Is it cards with ladies looking to the left? I don't think there's any of those in the history of Magic. I don't think so. There's one right there. Shit, that is a late... There's two. Oh my god. There's two in the literal pack that I, that I just looked at. Seems like you were wrong. It does seem like that. There's no... Uh, I actually like Knights. Ah. What if we get to play this early and then start? Yeah, let's just take this. That card's. Oh, it's your boy. I'm, I'm so glad Ryan Spain re added this to the cube. The best ninja of all time. I'm going to let you finish. But Fallen Shinobi has, is the best ninja of all time. That thing? This is a late Mox Diamond. I'm okay with it. Never used it before. Cards with ladies looking left, or ladies, or people looking left. See, like we're really. So it goes ladies, whatever people, and then fill in the rest. What's whatever? I don't know. Robots, <laughs> kitty cats, doggies. Candle Arbor seems like a weird card to include. Yes. I'm going to take a load. You know, if High Tide doesn't do anything, and High Tide doesn't win you the game, it just makes a lot of mana. I don't know. Much work, dude. Well, no, oh, over there. Okay. Oh, Ark, appreciate the stip, buddy. I want to let me write it down. Let me write it down. Academy Rector. Academy damn near killed her. I'll take the Brain Geyser. What the hell? Michael, did you like that one? Yeah, what the hell? Rain guys, you can target your opponent too, right? You can kill them with it if you have like a bajillion man. Yes. Okay. I like Liliana better than Looter. But it's double black. Uh, interesting. Fan of looting. Just give me all the cards. I don't want to put them. I don't want to put them away. Give them to me. I want to keep them. This is all very fascinating. I think it's still a better pick. We're not crazy or anything. That don't matter. You, you, looting, you never looted? It's very good. I want to end up more cards in the left. 
Uh huh. But sometimes you don't have that option, so you loot. No. Okay. No, there is an icon. Yeah, but our Sundering Titan didn't come back. Mike is so articulate. It's unbelievable. Right, Mike? Articulate. There's a mana drain. Putting it in the pile. No, I mean. I do like a cauldra complete. There's a ponder too. Man, we got consider and preordain. We can have a ponder. When in doubt, beat them to death. Complete it up. <laughs> what about man? Yeah. Man, mana leaks OP, bro. Yeah, but it doesn't win the game. But it could prevent you from losing the game, and that's important. That is important. Unless they have three extra mana. Mm. Mm. Oh yeah, give me that Grimothy. I actually, I meant to drag it, but my finger double-clicked. Yeah, blame your finger. Uh, okay. It's got a mind of its own, you know? Does it? Feels like it. Does it? You said your finger did it, not you, so... Does it? Okay, we're looking at good old Irk Tenors. I think my job would be easier if I had a monitor like this. Too bad it's not a possibility. Where'd it go? That was a long time ago? Okay. Anything good in this pack? Shouldered. Oh, Thran Dynamo. This pack's actually looking saucy. Is it just... That's pretty good. Is it just Thranathy? Yeah. I hate passing shoulder, but I like getting artifacts, you know? So that's where I'm at. <gasps> oh, sweetie pie. That is a sweetie pie. Uh, last week, when me and John played Commander, uh, one of our players played a turn two Thran Dynamo into a turn three Ugin. And we had no creatures on board. We did not win that game, as it turns out. So you guys won? The opposite of that. Emery. Oh, wow. This deck is coming together. Beautiful. How many artifacts we got here? One, two. This was very good last time, especially with an Emery. I was just like, wow. Look at this. Oh, that's, yeah, that's pretty dirty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Could also be Everflowing Chalice. I also don't hate Ancestral. What's the pick, guys? Everflowing or Mind Slaver? Take the cool one. It's quite good. Hmm. We're a little light on Lincoln, so it's kind of... Oh, Baleful Strix or Blightsteel? Probably Baleful Strix. Every time I take Blightsteel, it's just too expensive. Yeah, 11's a lot. It's true. Oh, Riftwing? All right, I'll take a Riftwing. Oh, Shark Typhoon, any non-creature spell? Yeah. Oh, that's pretty gross. I know. Disgusting. I'll take a Chooper. You didn't play it? Hmm. hmm. Helm of Awakening is interesting. Oh, Rakdos Signet? Wow, that's a good... That's a goody-goody. That's a good time. I guess it's Tezzeret. Last pick. What's it going to be? It's all the modes of that one. That Tezzeret. He's kind of mad. He's a guy like a 5-5 five five or something. They all do that. They always make a thing of 5-5, five five, right? Target artifact is a 5-5. Five five. Look at the top five of your library. <laughs> oh, he makes a permanent Every time. Five five. That's pretty good. Uh, look at the top five cards of your library. You're going to fill an artifact among them and put it in your hand. That and then not have any text, actually. It never works. What? Maybe Every if you time build we your deck terribly. Every time we, we have an effect like that, even when we usually have plenty of hits. Oh, you just wish? Always, yeah, exactly. So that, that line doesn't exist. It just says plus one when you get a loyalty counter. Probably going to include these lands. 26. I need three cuts. It's too much. Take Fatal Push out. I'll board that thing in if I need it. Should we be playing ten of these? What? Did we pick the looter or no? No. I feel like the odds of us ninjing I'm that starting are like... to, oh, We got Baleful Strix, huh? It's a two-card combo. You're probably right. I, I kind of agree with you. 
I hate that I do, but I kind of do. We got Shark Typhoon. Just make a shark on turn three. Make a 1-1 shark and then turn four or Shinobi. Yeah. Never mind. I really have my two. I was going to say Mono Blue, but I'm like, no, my two is worth it. Plus we have Mox Diamond, Underground Sea, Mox Jet, Rakdos Signet, so it's like... Yeah, but without Mind Twist, I don't think it would be worth the splash for a Baleful Strix. <laughs> what is Vesuvian Duplin, Duplinmancy? I don't even know. Duplomancy? I don't even know what that is. Seems like a made-up card. I think you just made that up. I think it's a March of the Machine card. I'm tuning for my blood. Oh, no, it's Dominaria United. Whenever you cast a spell that targets only a single artifact or creature you control, create a token. This feels like a commander card, so I'm surprised you don't know it. The problem with that is, like, it doesn't actually make the copy itself. Timeless Lotus is good enough, yes, because, like, you you go Timeless Lotus into Inkwell, Agent, Mind Twist, any of those, plus it's also an artifact for Metalworker. It's uh, just another Born Power Stone kind of effect. Yeah, I'd be hard-pressed to cut any artifacts here. And we only need one cut, so I don't think it's going to be that. I'm actually tempted to cut Factor Fiction. Yeah. I mean, we have a bunch of stuff. I always feel like it's kind of slow. It is kind of slow, and I hate to say it because it's just a classic, but... I often don't play it in my Commander decks anymore. So this is 12, 13, 14, 15, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Yeah, this seems good. Those are numbers. Oh, wait. Should we be playing the Meat Hook Massacre? Double black? No, I'll board that thing in if we need it. What are you, insane? Yeah. What are you, a crazy lunatic? Yes. Oh, no. What's that crazy card you're looking at? Nissa? No, it's from like the new set. No, it's from an old set. This is very confusing. It's from Urza's Legacy. It could be true, then I don't know. There's too many magic cards these days. But it's from an old set. You could be lying. Couldn't be. Would never. Bet. Don't bet. It's bad for you. It's gambling. Yeah, this is a keeper. You think it's going to be Mox Jet on top of the library that we get to play on turn one and then cast Rona? That would be cool. I agree. I like cool stuff. So. Streamers guess what opponent is playing based on their play history. Uh, I mean, it's basically just knowing what specific MTGO players play. Like, But I don't think that really applies in limited. Unless you're playing against like Luis and he's playing Storm because that's what he's always playing really. So, Look at this. What a little knucklehead. I wonder how many drafts of his like Storm percentage wise. There's got to be someone who... Four, I think. Four percent. Seems incorrect. No, it's correct. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, oh, that's a hot little number. What is that funny to you? Yes, it's hilarious. Tell me why. Hilarious. Tell me why. Ain't nothing but a Michael V. Well, it is a turn later than we wanted it, but. So we can mind twist for two? I was just feeling we Emery. I think so too. Might just be this though. What does the back half of that card do? Uh, it's coming as a, basically a Phyrexian Obliterator. Whenever a source deals damage to it, uh, an opponent exiles their hand, a card at random from their hand, uh, and you can cast it without paying its mana cost. Hmm. It's really kind of wild. It's actually very good. It's like a looter that's also a very good threat in the late game. It seems kind of busting. And you get to untap it if you play Legendary, so that we can untap it if we play... Yeah, I'm just going to play this guy. Lady. I forget. Can you transform? Is it a sorcery only thing? No. You can transform whenever you want. Uh, stick. This does say activate only as a sorcery, though. So... Oh. I don't, I, don't think it's a I don't think it's specific to transforming, but I, oh. it does say it on these. So that looks like a reminder text. Does it not? No, the reminder text is, oh, the, the, is for okay, the yeah, yeah. mana. Gotcha. 
I hate when they're like, oh, this card would be so sick. And they're like, only as a sorcery. And I'm like, dang. It's less sick now. I mean, it's two mana and four mana. It's not really that. See, look at all these lands we got, man. It's also awesome to play this as a commander, but like, they never flipped her. And I'm like, but why? I mean, it's only three here, but Avenger, Oracle, and a Mox Diamond. It's pretty good. I think tell the Oracle seems great. Tell me why, Michael. I just did. See, now we can loot two of these lands out of our hand next turn. And while I know Michael doesn't like looting... What does that, that stinking card do? Landfall. That's pretty sick. It's basically like an upgraded Lotus Cobra, you know? Yeah, but for one thicker, and but it's also thicker as a creature. For one thicker, and it's also thicker as a creature. Yes, yeah, so if you have fetch land, it just triggers both. It's pretty... Tell me more. Pretty nasty. Oh, God, they're going to do their last card? Oh, no, they're just upgrading? Sounds good. Oh. I didn't realize it was like the first time you had mana, the second time you do this. But every time it's a mana, plus it's more if you have it a second time. That's real good. Bro, I know. Bruv, no way. Bruv, it's true. Discard a card. We'll get rid of this black mana. It's true. So we're going to go one, two, three. Medi Mix Workerson. And then we're going to Emrena. Oh, we hit a walking ballista? Oh, God. Being able to get that back infinite times? Come on. Wait. You can just do that forever, basically? You target Emery. You target with Emery, and then you cast it. And then you target Emery with cast it. You target with Emery and cast it. You target with Emery and cast it. You I feel like if we untap, they're just dead, right? You just... It's not going to be good, especially if you draw an artifact for this metal worker. You just killed their <laughs> whole board. It's going to be a glorious day. Of course, day. they're going to play something gross right now. It's going to be annoying, so... I don't think so. They got... No, it's a wolf boy. No, it's more. It's a queen. That's, That's actually terrible. I know. I've only got walking bullets, though. I mean, I think you still play it, but those bees are all dead. Yeah, call me the exterminator. All you can drink coffee. Artifact. It sounds like death. Inkwell Leviathan. Ready? Okay. It's still pretty good. Reveal it. Play it. Oh, it's going to happen right now. It's going to be an absolute. This is going to be a massacre. Scene. They're all dead. Every one of them. Wait, don't you want to play your mox first? It doesn't do anything. It adds one man on the board and two men in the hand and one in the bush. <laughs> and you couldn't avoid saying it. But I would have done the same, so. I didn't check the math. You clearly did, so. Now I see. It's just, it's all over. They're all dead. One in the hand is worth a two in the bush. Yeah, they just kill the mana guys, right? You can let the bees live for a turn. Yes, let the bees live. I didn't realize Emery doesn't make you exile. That's disgusting. It's murder. No, that's why you can keep doing the... Uh, what do you call it? Gee, that's so good. I need to put that in my bread deck. Holy shnikes. I have Emery in it, but not... Probably just pass Ballistic. here for now. Yeah, there's no reason to not like do it at the end of the turn, right? Or in response to something. I can do whatever I want. Anything? You can do whatever you like. Interesting. God, this is real good too. Jesus. It comes in a cool art. Gotta love them cool arts, you know. Bzz. 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 Bye. You know. You're not going to have enough bees for your Starbucks, you know? Wow. <laughs> Look, I drew another artifact, man. It's all happening. The game is super over. If they maybe kill Emery on their turn, they might have had a chance, but... I don't feel like they got any backup uh, non-creature combos sitting around, so... See ya. Why is it asking me to respond to everything I'm doing? this program is not the best mm. 
bzz, bzz. Really brutal. And you can just finish it off by flipping that thing. Well, actually, you don't need to. The blitz is just going to do literally everything for you, so. The fact that they didn't concede right there is very impressive. They had two turns of knowing I got walking ballista on, on retainer. I can maybe see missing it the first time, but. Okay. I'm going to get the Monarch, baby. Baby, we monarchin. I'll loot here. It's going to be a land. I can easily just get rid of it. See? Simple. Simple. Simple transaction. Artifact? <laughs> they're like, wait a minute. They're just going to keep doing this. It finally sunk in. I like they're like, oh, they were, they were like, Court of Bounty. Let's see what we draw. Land? Okay, that'll do. Okay, so Meat Hook Massacre can come in here. Liliana, Fatal Push. Chupacabra. One, two, three. Take out Lodi Boy. Add a couple more Swampers. This is, yeah, that seems good. I added three. I took out one, so I got to take out two more. Is that right? I added Ravenous, Liliana, Fatal Push, and Meat Hook. Get your Meat Hooks off of me, Michael. Uh, get rid of Slavery. yeah okay I can see mine Sliver coming out that's fine that's all right and Strix seems good because they're combat based take out mana leak because it's based on um yeah based on mana this is not the best hand but you can set up was Wally. That's true. Giving you the little side eye, you know. What this hand's great. We got a preordain and a consider, bro. I just wanted to have all artifacts so you can just do a vomit, but this is pretty good. Yeah, do a vomit. Oh wow. If I'm more beside him, kind of leaning back. Yeah, he's literally like right next to me. Oh, it's because I'm being. It's because you're being ghosted, bro. Yeah, I'm being eaten by the card. Captain America's here. Yeah, look, you see the background there. <laughs> Quality. Qu Quality. I understood that reference. Probably no one else would. Where's that from? It's from Justin High. It's an original. I don't think so. Oh, it is for sure. I don't think so. It's about the time when he thought the word quality was so funny. He purposely, on all of his papers, spelled it quality. And then on the end of the paper, there was a picture of a quail that he drew by hand. That doesn't sound real. I think you just made that up right now. You would think, but it, it happened. <laughs> that is literally what that comes from. I don't from. know. There's no way I haven't told oh, you God, that, that guy's bananas. What's his flip side do? Something ridiculous? It's really good. Mill 10 and then put up to two creatures from among the milled cards onto the battlefield. Distribute seven one one counters among any number of target creatures, seven. Okay. and then until the end of turn, creatures you control gain tap one. This creature fights a creature you don't control, and then he just turns back into Vorinclex again. Holy shnikes! It's not it seems, bad. It seems pretty good. It's like every time they print that card, it's pretty good. Yeah, I feel like this hand is relatively slow, you know, compared. The worst Vorinclex was. Insane in Commander. Are you high right now? Yeah. <laughs> the original one. You're, oh, you're probably just super tired. That's what it is. Yeah, I mean, I've been up since 5.15 a.m. So, yeah, we're we're beyond Cause you sound conscience. Yeah, no, basically I'm, dead. Yeah, I'm dead. You're like, the Warren Clex was good in Commander. And I was like, oh, my God, is he okay? He's slurring his... I think he's having a stroke. Looking drunk, basically. Y'all remember when Doug turned into Quail Man? I do. I also remember that. Jesus, this guy I was is, there. This guy's really good. I don't know how to beat this guy. I was there when the text was written, which, or whatever he says. I've never seen that movie, but it's a good quote. Switch line or wardrobe, whatever it's called. Is that movie? You guys know that meme? Someone in the chat's got to know that meme. 
No idea. <laughs> Never heard of it. Six. This is six mana, dude. He's so close to flipping. And then we die. I mean, we're already dying, but. But then we die faster. Faster, yeah. Man, maybe mana like is worth keeping in, you know? How much is the front side of that guy? Six dollars. Five. Five mana for a six six with trample and reach that you search for two forests. I was gonna follow up with how much does the back half of them cost and then go a bit, but tell me about your back half. Whoa, buddy. Told me about it. The lion, the witch, and the wardrobe. Okay, I guess we're gonna pass the turn. Oh, you're still the monarch, eh? Okay, I guess you get to put a creature from your hand on the battlefield. It's gonna be Hornet Queen. Oh, Avenger of Zendikar. That's actually worse. I'm gonna go to the next game. He also gets to play an extra land, so they're gonna be like, I don't know, 35, 100 millions. And 35, 100 millions plus one. Yeah, Michael B. they always get the plus one, you know, on the butt. I understand. I think our, I think our deck is good. I just don't think that was a good hand. I think they just had a great hand that crushed us. He sounds like he's doing radio for NPR. I want a microphone that makes me sound like an old-timey broadcaster. This is and I don't Michael. know how to do that. Oh, What's God. the name of the radio show in, in uh, PNR? I don't know. You know what I'm talking about, though. I mean, I know. I'm going to mulligan this hand. That's a fucking banger of a hand. Holy shnikes. He's an owlet, but otherwise. And you get I a have draw. an owlet, Michael. Cause me great. <laughs> That's okay. Yeah. You'll be okay. Any one land and we're golden. I am not dead. I just have a Bajinga job that eats away at my soul every day. Bazorples, my dude. Oh, I guess we didn't need a land. We had a Tolarian Academy, which triggers for two. Never mind. I'm stoop stoop. So actually we didn't even want this. We just want to go Tolarian into this, into this. Nice job, stoop stoop. I'm so stoop stoop. It's fine. They just say the first owl is the hardest. That's what they tell me. After you get that first owl, though, you're ready to go. Hey, why did you think you were stupid? Explain it to me one more time. I thought I needed one land, so then I would have three mana to cast Worn Power Stone, because I didn't think this was going oh. to count any art. I, didn't, I was like, like, I don't have any artifacts yet. So. Yeah, yeah. But then, I was like, oh, I can just do this. I do also feel like the old board of the art kind of makes you forget it's an artifact. Play Thranny, baby. Oh, Thranny baby. And then you know what else we're going to do? What? We're going to tap it for a Warney. And it's... <laughs> nope, not going to... We're going to draw nothing that costs above two mana. I mean, we have a Liliana and we can just kill this dude, so that's pretty good. It's all right. It's very good. This also adds one to four mana right now. That's pretty good. Sure. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Those are numbers. Yeah, eleven mana. 12 mana. I mean, we're, we're Gucci. Nah, I haven't played Pilgrim forever. He doesn't believe in it anymore. I don't have a good game anymore. I don't feel like going anywhere to play it. Cool, they exiled a channel to cast Force of Vigor. Seems good. I had one group I was playing with, but they did cash style, which I'm not a huge fan of. I prefer tournament style. I prefer tournament style. Just what I like. Cash games are... I know this is a stupid thing to say, but I feel like my luck is absolutely terrible in cash games. And I'm probably just a worse cash game player, if I'm being honest. It's are you being much, honest? It's a much different dynamic. This is probably too poker nerdy, but I'll shut up now. Oh, if it isn't the tuna that was undreamt. I was like, I actually can't read what their name yeah, says it's, on that. It's like yeah. dark blue on black yeah, background. Right. Yeah, I was like, that's invisible. But what up, tuna? One, two, three, four, five, six. Well, I don't really got much going on, so. We're just living the life, you know? So she's the one with the alt that's like basically unbeatable, right? Uh, yeah, it makes... Yeah, every time it makes an extra zombie. makes forever. two extra zombies each yeah. turn. So if I have four, yeah. it makes six. If I have none, it makes two. Is this Baleful Strix getting in there? 
Is he doing it's doing the deed? Also, no, no. good one. <laughs> I was gonna lie. I said I would stop talking about poker, but then you said a poker thing. Okay, Michael. Let me ask you something about poker. That's pretty good. Oh, we're time spiraling. Oh, that's pretty good. It depends on how many times you flip the coin. Technically, I was close to losing a $500 bowl at once. Time spiral with fast bond is... That's a combo right there, my dude. Yes, I accept. Anyone who plays real poker is like, that's nothing to lose. I'm like, yeah, but it's not my job, so... Man, I would have loved a Mystic Confluence or a Force of Will in this hand. It's only seven cards. What could they give you? A Fatal Push? <laughs> uh, sure. They have three cards left. This is not exciting, I'm going to be honest with you. Court of Balance. Bounty where I'm going to immediately get the Monarchy. Deal. Well, not immediately. Well, they're not going to be able to use the ability where they put a creature into play is really the point I'm getting at. And also I could try to find a counter spell. I mean, if anyone knows of an online poker game where the players are terrible and I can make a lot of money doing it, let me know. Yeah, let them know. That was great while I was doing that for a while. That's like a side gig. Now his job is too soul-sucking to oh. do anything else. Wow. Got a line on a new gig, though, so we'll see. That's really fucking good. It's pretty good. Still didn't deal with Liliana, though. Yeah, but it's pretty good. <sighs> Tempted to just get the Baleful Strix back. That's really obnoxious. You might say. Hmm. She only has to go seven. So I need to do it this turn, next turn, and then the following turn. That's a lot. Yeah. They only have they one card have in monarch, hand. Right, so. I mean, it's inevitability. So I think you actually do get this, this, this Strix back. Because it also draws you a card, right? So, I don't know. I feel like this is a smarter play. It's a more conservative play, but... We get Strix, we pay it for two. Then we play a Signet. Or we play Signet first. Oh, no. I'm not really in financial trouble. I just it, The job is soul-sucking and it's stressful and doesn't pay quite enough two, for the, three, what I'm doing. Jesus. Um, bottom, top. So we play Strix, play Signet. I think that's uh, Metal Metal Worker seems really good here though. Yeah, let's you untap with so much potential. I think you play that. Yeah, I guess that's fine. Uh, I don't like it, but. Future, though, you know? Michael, I always think of the future. Also, this technically gives them the two threats to deal with. Well, they get to put something into play for free, and I assume their last... Oh, they didn't put anything into play. Well, that's fantastic. fantastic. Well, then they're probably dead. That was my concern. Uh, what's the job? I still work for the same bank, same company. I'm a resolution manager. In other words, when a customer asks for a manager, sure. they deal with me. And now I've worked all the departments, and it's it explains itself. When someone asks for a manager... You can understand why that might be stressful. That's what I do. For not much more money. And they started cutting off over time, which is really sad. Deal with me! Or are they just going to go like nuts and get all the lands in their deck? Sure. Yes, I do deal with Karens on the somewhat regular. You mean on the reg? Yeah, on the reg. Probably nice. get one or two Karens a day. Most people aren't that bad, but... Just can't get enough. 
I just can't get enough. Well, they're really, really going ham with the basics here, you know? I'd like to speak to the stream's manager. <laughs> Me too. Where is he? Let's you draw. I don't know what you can complain about, though. It's a free service. Interesting. I don't think we want that. Oh, we do want that, though. Oh. Oh. Big choopers. Check it and see. Yeah. It's draining. I'm applying for another bank in a back-end position that deals with fixing loans. Uh, it also pays, like, anywhere from 10000 to 20 something thousand more a year, so... I have a reference at the place. God, Michael is so rich. Well, future me might be, but <laughs> quote unquote rich. Oh yeah, Affinity would definitely be the stream manager. That's a good call. So we got one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four. So we can play choops here. Big choops. Check it and see. Oh, just like me. No, we can't play choops here. Yes, we can. You can if you do it right. So they have one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, let's do that. So next time we get to Ultimate Liliana right now, we get to keep up Mystic Confluence. I guess that's good. I feel like the pets would be the uh, mascot of the stream, not necessarily the manager. Well, they're not doing anything, so that's cool. Yeah, well, that is kind of cool. And they still didn't put anything into play, so I think we've got this match. Yeah, I feel once we become the monarch, it's probably just over. Also, we're going to untap with the alt, so that's seems good. That I think that's how, what, how victory smells. Also, you have confluence up, right? So they're just basically totally dead. I thought I just said that. You probably did. I'm barely alive right now. Oh my god. I'm already not great at words or whatever. Just funny considering my job, but what's your job? You're unemployed? That'd be sick. That's a bummer. It'd be sick. sick if you were unemployed? Yeah, but like with still money. I'm not sure that's how that works. Unfortunately not. That's the problem. That is a bummer. Yeah. All right, here we go. They're going to do something. Something dirt, dirt McGirt. <sighs> What's it going to be? Chinese restaurant. What's it going to be? Oh my God. Yes. Tap out. For a hydroid crassus. Yes. I don't think so, my dude. Counter target spell, draw two cards. It feels so good. Counter target spell. You're tapped out, right? Yeah, make sure. I want to make sure you don't have any mana for one, yeah, two, they're three, tricking four, you. five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Yeah, okay. I think that'd be easier to display, but well, you know. Me no no. And that's gotta be the concession, yeah. That'll be the end. Plan on. I mean, they are on a three turn clock if you just attack with your robot and your chicken thing. Attack with your robot and your chicken thing. Grab was like a chicken, yeah. You know how we do. Well, they eat. Never mind. They get to keep drawing cards from that, from that bounce, from that uh, monarchy. This turn they don't. Maybe. I mean, I guess you could not attack them. That'd be oh well. That's just choice. that's just insult to injury. Am I that's right? just that's just mean, really. It's not necessary. It's, it's not, not good. very good, is it? Hey man, I want to be the monarch. The crown is mine. So we got four. Six, seven. Actually. Dead? Wait, no. I don't think I got 14, bro. Oh, bro. Um, 
One, two, three, four, five, six. Turn clock, did I mean? Three, so many ways. Four, five. Yeah, that's fine. Let's see any way they win this game. Make some zomboids. Awesome card, boys. I really commend them for for, for sticking it out. Yeah, I don't know yeah. what they think their one outer is. I can't. Like, even if they wrap your whole board, you still have the emblem. We won. Oh. I wasn't sure. Yeah, it was it was real touch and go for a minute there. Yeah, we did lose that one game with the Liliana emblem, which was ridiculous. You're ridiculous? Yeah. Swipe the notice. Yeah, swipe it. Oh, new Diablo's up. Can you stream that? I mean, they're doing a server slam this weekend, so it's basically just like test out the server. Uh, I'll keep this hand. We really need a. Yeah, I think our opponent. What? You said GG Frank in chat. Oh. Oh, Power Guy. Yeah, good games. That was our opponent because I remember Power Guy was his name. Thank you. I'm curious what he was looking to draw. I mean, it's not necessarily looking to draw. Sometimes you just, just want to know. You're not dead, you know, so it's like. Might as well keep breathing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know, might as well. They have one card in hand. Here's a good one. Oh, I forgot we had that. Yeah, they're just, they just lose, right? Like, the game's just over? I mean, that was something. That was a. Uh, with all your strength, mold to zero you have five nothing to threaten me with. Yeah. I mean, also, if you get the golem down. Yeah, right, you added that one. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, that's pretty gross. I mean, Draw. if we hit a land, we yeah, can go mox just, into golem. Super over. I mean, I guess they've got a lot of mana, so they can afford to pay one extra. Oh, watch this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Just, just put it in the garbage. Stop, he's already dead. Yeah, that one? There you go. <laughs> this feels correct, is it? What's your argument for not doing it? Because they have so much mana that, like, this might hurt us more than it hurts them. Bro, it's a 5-3 attack. I guess that's true. It is a powerful boy. If you look at the tiny bright corner, it tells you that it has the power and toughness. What's the 3 is the one at how much it deals, right? Yeah. If you got some cards out. <laughs> like what? You got stupid Saltai Dragon. I don't forget the name of it. Uh, it's not a Saltai Dragon. It is a Bant Dragon. It is a Bant Dragon. His name is Arcade. I feel, yeah, I feel bad because it's like one of John's favorite decks. And Don't feel bad. He deserves Oh, they're, they're at eight, too. I forgot this is such a fucking big clock. They're at 82? Oh, no. It's going to take forever. It's going to take forever. Yeah, one turn. I can flip this next turn, actually. So also, I think you paid three for it. Oh, you have to because yeah, this is. Do you even understand what? Lo it. Oh, that there. This is gonna be. This is gonna be great. Mm, that's a blocker. Oh wait, do we have enough managers? Yeah, we do. You want the golem boy? It's flipping it. I'm not. I'm activating oh. an ability. Jeez, <laughs> how many times do we have to clarify? And this guy has trample as well, so they got to oh, block like here and here. Didn't have trample, would suck. It was sick. Sick. All right. Well. You know, I was talking crap on looters, but that 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 seems like a really busted commander. It's two mana to start. Ooh. Ooh. Let's transform four. It's six, but you can pay the Phyrexian, so it's five. It's five. Wow, that was a game right and there. And a commander man. paying two life literally, means literally nothing most of the time. It means nothing. You know that card black market connections? Yes, it's great. It's I got to place Phyrexian Arena in my cube. I got to play with it. It was just a pre-con deck. It was just like, and it had as it in it. And I just paid six every time and I won the game and it just literally that card won me the whole game. God, you're a maniac. It's wild. It's not very good, is it? 
No, it was. It was very. Oh, good. it was good. That's great. Yeah. That's good to hear. Plus, the shapeshifter part was relevant. So I didn't see many creatures from them, right? We saw. I guess we saw Kiki Jiki, Wall of Roots, Fast Bond, and Vorinclex, and that was like their. Yeah, so he's doing like a Kiki thing with backup, like and a shield or value things. So maybe Fatal Push is good there's enough. Like five color nonsense. That's good. Gitchy, gitchy, ya, ya, da, da. Wow, it's a... Uh, I'm just talking about the real lady marmalade, okay, Michael? I, I get it. I, I understand about the, the marm and the lades. The marm and the lades. I'm going to take out an agent here. Seven man is a lot. Hope not. Which one is the swamp? Actually... Kind of yeah, right. this is good. Yeah, We're good. just gonna top deck a mox em, uh, mox jet, so it's fine. Yeah, you don't. You can consider it. Oh, that's that's basically good enough. They provide the finest cringe. I think really we keep you. this. I don't think so, actually. That's interesting. That's interesting. I'm very interested in everything that's happening here. Extremely interested. I'm tempted to kill this and then just pass. And then play Metal Worker next turn. Yeah, do the murder. Never let him on tap with the thing. Smart. Always do the murder. Because, like, Signet's going to add two with a Metal Worker. So it's like, it's almost better in my hand. AVM. Always be murdering. That's smart. I really appreciate your strategy. Except for outside of games, and it's very dangerous. Dude, I have so many artifacts in my hand. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I found out the other day that in America, the solving rate for cool. murders is 50%. And I was like, how's that possible? And then I found out it was real. That just, like, there's a 50% chance if you kill someone, you just get away with it in America. Which yeah, is if you're a serial insane. killer. Half the serial killers, you know, they're all free. All right, whatever. Hmm. The wall roots bug? What's that do? I don't know. Probably explode the game or something. What's that do? Add a bajillion mana. See, now I wish I kept my mana because they had a lightning bolt. I would have had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven mana. That would have been amazing. I didn't. I was a fool. First forty-eight taught us this. I think they could improve upon it by now, yeah. That's a pretty old show. That's pretty good. I don't even know what the first 48 is. It's a trick card show. Really? Yeah. Oh, good. If you know the name, then you know. Well, it can't it has to do with like, the first 48 hours someone's missing, I think, was the idea for that name. Were you some kind of TV show guru? Yeah, I didn't think so. Now you claim to be. Sounds like you were claiming it. Not even a little bit. Always. It's confusing. Every day. I mean, every day is confusing. It's every day, bro. So what I really draw? Six. That's pretty good. Guess we're dead. Guess I'll die. Yeah, I'm good. All right. Did I bring in Choops? Yep, I did. All right. Got a Riffling Cloudscape. That guy could be good, too. Could be. But is it? I don't know. Hard to say. God, I can't believe it. Like, if they didn't kill that metal worker, bro. Oh, I'd love to hear that Mike's British... British government plan. Let's hear it. He's such a politician. I'll tell about the British government plan. Every day. Oh, hold on. For some reason, my speakers keep not working. So I'm like using sound bites and stuff, and it's just they're not even coming through, you know? All right. So here we go. Mike, tell us about your British government plan. Every day. Chicken Sunday. <laughs> that makes sense. That's smart. 
No. Sometimes you look back on things you've done and you were like, that wasn't me, right? <laughs> <laughs> it's beautiful. Also, so, looking back, I uh, do not like that haircut. It's beautiful. Everything about you is just beautiful. It's too edgy. It didn't work. But now you know, you know. My hair is kind of edgy now. It's like spiky. I don't whatever. think I want either of these. I kind of like Academy maybe, but I can't cast anything with the Academy. It would seem worse. Okay. I mean, any policy is better than Brexit. It's not very good, is it? Oh, that was really good. Wow. Now where's that academy? Oh, great. They're going to kill it. They didn't do anything. Stupid. What a dumb dumb. Six, seven, eight. Mm. I think Sunny D is a little smoother. Easier to take down, you know? Smooth. Not the drink itself that burns your throat, of course, but... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're literally two mana away from Mind Slaver locking them. Seems good. It's not bad. Pop also, I had a uh, funny thought while watching that clip. I was like, man, I used to be fatter. And then I was thinking about how I like, used to eat whole pizzas, and I stopped doing that. And then I start doing it again because I work out like a maniac. Yeah, you still <laughs> it's eat the, the whole pizza, pizza saga, yeah. It's the Mike Pizza saga, if you know it's what just, I mean. It's so good. <laughs> Pizza's so good. Oh, the Castle Garen Three, bridge. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I guess we just play this guy. Yeah, they have unique pies. Have you ever been to the Castle Garen Brig? Playing around in the dirty. Castle Garen Brig. Have you been to the Castle Garen Bridge? Mm, they have delicious glass pies. Uh, it's like glass oh, pies. Hey. Why glass pies? <laughs> hey, <gonna> Jesus. Like, <laughs> fucking seriously? <laughs> I don't even know what you said. Like some bullshit about delicious glass pies. <laughs> oh, Jimmy? Like, I don't even know, man. <laughs> Wild. You witnessed it. What's a glass pie, Michael? You gotta go to the castle. <laughs> 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 literal, oh, this is <laughs> this peak era. I drink glass every night, boy. Why would you drink it every night? Powdered glass! <laughs> you drink powdered glass every yeah. night? Yeah. What the fuck is wrong with you? It's good for the sternum. The sternum? Mm -hmm. How is it good for the sternum? It oh, that's is, it. man. I can't tell you why. I wish I understood where my oh my god oh my eyes broken. His eyes broken. I'd like to say there's a we win the match. Dunzo in the bunzo. That glass powder thing has any meaning or reference to something? It doesn't. I just just out of nowhere. I have no idea. Yeah, but it's good for the I sternum, it so it makes sense <laughs> that you would have. The fact that I'm gainfully employed. Here, let's listen again. Cool. Are you yeah. drinking glass? I drink glass every night, boy. Why would you drink it every night? <laughs> powdered glass! You drink powdered glass every yeah. night? Yeah. I think what I like about it is... What the fuck is wrong with you? It's good for the sternum. Yeah. The sternum? Mm -hmm. How is it good for the sternum? Just is, man. Just I'll is. I'll tell you why. I think my favorite part of that clip is like how aggressive it starts. <laughs> Are you drinking glass? <laughs> Are you drinking glass? And I'm like, every night. Well, I appreciate your consistency at least. You know, you're drinking it every night. That's just really, it's good. Oh, I'm crying because it's so good. Don't it's cry. Dirt. Don't cry, Michael. Tears. I don't think I can ever top stuff like that. I don't think I got that in me anymore, you know? Well, look at this mana drain, though. You ever seen that? That one? In real life? No. I've never seen that one. It's powdered glass. Mm. Fascinating. Oh, Jesus. Why, two out of three of every draft I'm in, my, play, my opponents have friggin' Black Lotus. 
Your black lotus thing for the simulacrum? That is the most unimpressive black lotus. That is literally not even worth it. Jesus. Did, did they realize that they just paid four mana to get two? It's actually in that negative. Like, I get, you get a two two, sure. Jesus. Am I crazy? Does that just seem a like a, a bad play? I right. don't like it personally. You and Mike are bringing so much joy over the years with your streams, banter, and jokes. By far my favorite MTG content people. I know how rough the job hunt can be, but I hope to see you stream more. A lot more. I hope you stream more. A lot more. If you know what I mean. Chanel, I appreciate that, buddy. You've been here I for ages, are my dude. Appreciated. I do like a good kind word. Yeah, wait, had Mutual kept up his powdered glass regimen? What silica based compounds do you grind and chug these days? So let me ask let me ask if this is normal. You guys can tell me if this is normal. Michael has a big thing. Is it's, it's the protein powder, right? Yeah. He has a big fucking 20 pound jug of protein Not powder. Oh, I'm sorry, it's like eight, whatever. It's humongous. So maybe it's two pounds. Two, 20 pounds, right? Okay, whatever. Minus a zero. Okay, two hundred pounds. Got it. Two million pounds. It's huge. It's huge. And sometimes he'll take the scooper that you that, that it comes with. He'll fill it with powder. No, you're mistaken. Okay, how do you do it then? Just expl just tell tell people how you do it, because clearly I don't know what I'm talking about. Okay, so that's not what I do with protein. That's with creatine. That's what I'm asking. So that's a different. That's not. That's in a little bag. It's white stuff. The reason I oh, do it's that, a little bag of white stuff, huh? <laughs> Got Walter White over creatine here. Creatine is a very safe. I'm not saying it's unsafe. Right. I, everybody knows what creatine does. Oh, well, a lot of people don't, actually. Oh, oh, okay. I literally never heard of it until I started <laughs> well, Actually, out. many people don't know anyway, what it is. Anyway, it doesn't really dissolve in anything. So you can just mix it with water. Like You can put it in a shake, but what happens is it settles at the bottom, so then there's just like a gross thing at the bottom. So I'd rather just mix the five, five grams of water and just shoot it. So I just do that. He takes a scooper. Yeah. He puts the powder in. Yeah. He puts the scooper under the water dispenser of the fridge. Mm -hmm. And then he just drinks it like that. Yeah, and then I'll put a little more in because at the bottom it clumps a little bit. and you know. It doesn't taste good. It's literally just medicine, basically. He loves it. I this like is, the effects that it gives me. This is his favorite snack. They say it's anywhere from 2 to 3% strength increase if you take it daily. And it's very safe. Wow, you are so strong. I'm trying. Are you trying? Yeah, bro. I'm trying, Lord. Bought those two plates the other day. I was feeling good about that. And then you dropped them on yourself. Well, got them. It was the bar, but you know. Sometimes you eat the bar. Sometimes the bar eats you. The bar usually eats you. It eats shoes. <laughs> it eats you. Creatine will make you shit water. Oh Jesus! I've never had that effect. That's because you got all that pizza in you. You know. Suck it up. It makes you uh, bloat a little bit when you first start taking it, sometimes for some people. but Oh, yeah, that's not. I appreciate that you tried to do this, but I personally don't want you to. So if that's, if that's okay with you, you know. Suck it up, suck it up. Oh, look at that beautiful baby boy. There's a lot of men, actually, now that we got Talarian Academy. It's at least four. At least so one, two, three, one, two, three, four. Hmm. I think we play this. We tap one to play this. Then if we really need to counter something, we have Talarian Academy to do so. To defend mutual, I used to do that too. Take shots of wacky stuff with my coworkers. We were working in the cafe and doing anything more, and we needed something to feel something. Well, that's not exactly the no, same. He's creatine doing it to get it you, into his system. Right, creatine doesn't make you. It doesn't have any like. It it's not like he's doing shots or, of barbecue sauce to, like make, like our friend Hat Hat Mike would do. Yeah, that's fine. And the barbecue sauce. You have four cards. One of them's like Carolina a line of gold. Yeah, that guy's got to go. Yeah, that guy just murders us. Uh, let's counter. Let's bounce. Who are we bouncing? Probably this guy. They make them uh, in gummies and stuff and pills, but they're like significantly more expensive. Like the powder's like almost nothing, like per gram or whatever if you buy it that way. So 
you just can't justify spending like five times the price for the gummies or the pills or whatever. So just, you know. This has been this has been Mike's weightlifting hour. I could go on for several, but I'm not gonna. Can you put it in Jello? We'll put you in Jello. How many grams a day? Five. The recommended amount. You guys ever seen a pig nose? Any more is irrelevant. All right, I gotta I gotta consider something real quick. All right, let me know what happens. Okay. I know a good amount about Commander. It's my favorite format. I've been playing it Ooh. forever. <laughs> I like that one. <laughs> Papa like, huh? This game is super over. Okay, so we got one. Bye. I need to play your... Yep. Rona? Yuppers. This is Herald of, the of the game. Invasion is the rest of that? C too much creatine can change the weather patterns around you to very rainy. Did you do this? It's all been my master plan. Oh my god. Let the hail cometh. Fatal push seems decent. I keep bringing in Fatal Push and Chupacabra. I'll take out two islands. Islands in the stream. That is what we are. Float away with me. Ooh. I will say on record that I actually do like cube better than commander. It's just I don't get to play. It's this harder much. to yeah. arrange a cube draft with your yeah. with your buds. With you boys. Okay, so we're gonna go turn two mana drain into mind twist. You got Lotus again? Oof. Oof. Fatal Fatal push one time. Oh, oh. oh. I'm a an actual Creature of some sort. Well, you see, what we're going to do here, Machul. Yeah, I'm listening. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to let you cook, as the kids say. Let me cook, bro. Like Walter White up in this piece. Fairly new player deck, uh, building a deck that's around 20 cards over. Really need some kind of take with you. How much do I need to donate for you guys to check that out? Oh, my goodness. I don't know. What's your price? $400,000. Okay, he wants $400,000 to... <laughs> I can do it for less. I'm not uh, sure I wasn't following, so let me... Oh, wow, they didn't play anything. Yeah, we'll talk about it. Oh, this is going to be... Uh, murder, I think, is the word. It's murder. That's what they gave you. You mean the case? That was the case that they gave me. Yeah, that, that is what I was referring to. Michael, let me ask you something. Have you ever had a dream that that you um you had you you long you clip. could you do you you want you you could do so you you do you could you you want you want him to do you so much you could do anything well, I, every day kid every day i kind of want to cycle the shark typhoon here but i also kid's a full adult now but you don't know his life no what's the thing with him oh my god oh, it's only slightly out of his budget <laughs> Poor people, am I right? Unbelievable. Hi, I'm yeah, poor. You can have that. I don't care about that. Hi, poor. I'm Frank. Dad jokes, ladies and gentlemen. More like bad jokes. What did you just say? More like bad jokes. I heard you. Hmm. Is this going to be a Jace the Mind Sculptor? Do I get to manage drain Jace the Mind Sculptor twice? Are they afraid? It's they're like he's not better than all. They're terrified. He was like, oh, no. Uh, done. Someone wanted to know what 20 cards to cut from their commander deck because they're over. They're a newer player. I'm just gonna rock you with my Sharku. See, that's not really my area, though. So that would be on Michael. I could do it for you. 20 lands, done. Don't do that. Don't do that. Wow. Do that. Is it Strix or is it Runa? People underplay lands permanently. Really? Yeah. Tell me more. No, people are greedy. Tell me more. Little jerks. Once you're playing high end, then it's different. I called the Rona Runa. Do you guys like that? Oh, what is this you're doing? They're casting a card called the Seaver Exarch. Exarch? Uh, Exarch. 
just doesn't really do anything for me. I'm just going to counter it. It's three mana next turn. That seems fine. Uh, cut all the cards that suck. 20 of them. For, give me the money. <laughs> give me the money. <laughs> the only problem with that is First like you get to send us a list and 20 cards is a lot. 20 cards is a lot. Just play a 120 card deck, you know? Just rule zero that. Rule zero anything. Can yeah. you not play Battle of Wits in Commander? That's really good. But usually, like, I mean, it's Commander. Like, if someone shows up the Battle of Wits deck, you just say yes. Don't just be say little, yes, little, you know? Little jerk. Look what you did, you little jerk. So I have seven mana, so I guess I can just mind twist them for four, which is five, and then I can still play Rona. <laughs> you got it. Oh, interesting. Well, that's pretty good in your in your in your grumper. Uh, on a serious recommendation, uh, Kieran, you should look up um, Game <laughs> Night's uh, <laughs> deck building template, the more updated one from like last year. It's got a great rule of thumb for playing like uh, thirty threats, ten ramp, ten card draw, ten removal. There's like a breakdown. It's a very good guide. I use it myself often. It's a breakdown. It's hardcore, bro. So hardcore, bro. They're in the pit, you know? <laughs> Doing all the pits. Yeah, you people getting stomped. That seems violent. I think I just mind twist for two and keep up confluence here. Nope, can't do that. Don't have the correct mana to do so. That's unfortunate. That does seem worse. I mean, they're just going to echo of eons, though. I don't think I care about that, I guess. I mean, they're going to do it anyway. Oh, maybe I can play Metalworker and then just keep up Mystic? Yeah, that seems fine. Let's do that. Mm, yeah, that's fine. Yeah, generally there's 36 to 37 lands, and then more or less, depending on there. Anything under 36, I wouldn't really recommend for someone who's new. That is fascinating. Counter it and draw. What if you didn't do that? I'm going to. I meant them. Because you're not running to it. Don't say you're not going to. Oh, they're going to counter my counter. You got it. You got it, champers. I also think a good rule of thumb is like... Artifacts and... Oh, make sure you don't have too many fun things and your deck still is functional. Like it has removal, <laughs> card draw, etc. Don't play any fun things in your deck, okay, buddy? Well, not too many fun things. No one's here to have a good time. We're here for a long time. It's Commander. Your fun things should be 29 cards to 30 cards. The theme, synergy, whatever you want to call it. The rest should be function. That's the easiest way to explain it. That is such an easy way to explain it. Thanks, bro. God, he's so smart. So smart. This is an aggressive attack here. All attacking is aggressive. <laughs> <laughs> he gave me the... <laughs> on that one. That's when I don't want to. I didn't open my mouth fast enough because I was like, I'm not going to laugh at this, so it doesn't matter. And then it was funny, and I was like, ah, oh, shit, I laughed at it. What if I'm all theme, but the theme sucks? Well, that's good sometimes. But you've you're... acknowledged the problem, so fix that, you know? Or if your pod just likes playing all decks that are worse than pre cons, I guess that's cool. Not really my thing, but. I actually kind of hate when, like, people try to be too nice in Commander and then no one does anything. I will keep that. It's kind of boring. You're kind of boring. Yeah. I'm a spike at heart, you know, so I like the faster pace commander lands. Okay. Papa. Anytime. Son. <laughs> okay. Papa. This seems like a good position to be in. I don't know Razmatazer, but. It is now Can my I be turn. You? I just want to be you. You want to be like Mike or Kukulo. Kukulo. Can you kill them somehow? No. With think. their own stuff? Yeah, I don't think you can do that. <sighs> what did we draw here? Pestermite? Can Jace put their own things on top of that library? I think you're just giving a Jace. They don't have a, a terrible hand here, so let's be let's be honest. Um, I don't want to go on. It's 
not great, Bobbo. Uh, let's go to their main, I guess. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six. You're right, there's not really much we can do. Wait, doesn't Jace go down to one if you minus him? No, it goes down to two. Oh, oh I, I actually do like that. Let's play Island. Goodbye to this card Kiki Jiki and Zealous Conscripts I guess no I'll let him keep the Kiki because it's really expensive so we'll get rid of Zealous oh we're not in there click OK uh, Kiki nope still not there okay click again this card, two cards. We're a good time. We're okay. saying, what are we saying? Pestermine and Zealous, right? Yeah, that seems fine. Attack with the monkey to see if they reveal something, but we've already used all their mana, so I don't think that's good. Yeah, I might just trade with the monkey. Trade with the monkey. What can he give you? That doesn't seem great, though. What this does the fine. monkey want back? I don't think it's going to let me solemn Kiki light Island mountain. Okay. Hunter's dreaming. Hunter's doing big dreams. His feet don't fit in the bed. So he looks crazy. One, two, three, four, five. Timeless Lotus. We have two counters up. Yeah, this is fine. They can hit with their stupid guy if they want. An hour two of the monkey? Yeah. <coughs> It's like a fun interaction. Everlasting life. I'd go for that. Burst lightning. I think any opportunity to interact so with a wild animal that doesn't murder you seems weird. like a fun time. Well, I guess it's just fine. That's, a, that's annoying. I'm really hoping to draw something here. Solemn. God, I really don't care about it, but like, <clears throat> that's fine. What? Manager? Then they have Kiki. Like, yeah, yeah but like, we're just not doing anything. Right, but then I just die to Kiki at some point. I'm not changing that by countering a Solemn Simulacrum. But they don't need it. They just copy their guy every turn. It's oh, the same yeah. two damage on the board. And they just got our preordain. You little bitch. Some states is illegal to own monkeys. That should probably be all states. Yeah, they're not really pets. Yeah, I know. It's a bad time waiting to happen. 
What can we draw here that'd be amazing? Um, fudge, I don't even know, man. Ballista could be very good. Uh, I agree with that. A braid? All right, well, that will mana leak. Kiki Light, Island Mountain, I assume you played a land. Yes, to the dumpster. Onward to the dumpster with you. Oh. oh. That's fascinating. That does the bouncy and the drawly. Probably just draw three, right? We just need gash. No, I want to bounce this and kill their Jays. That's also good. like that better you're smart thanks bruv one no we'll keep the black in there one two three oh very good very good sir very good yes two three four Big choopers, check it and see. Check with your choopers. Every day. <laughs> yes, check with your choopers. If you don't, you never know what's going to happen. Anything can happen. And we get to keep managing up, huh? Okay. All right. That was helpful. Oh, look at this. Look at this guy. Sure. They're going to tap down the choops. Not the choopies. They're going to untap. Sure. I have five cards in hand. Jeez. No. Don't like that. Don't do it. That's fine. <laughs> Unless they draw a force, it would be bad or a pack or whatever. Well, they still have to have another blue card in hand, which we don't know they have, so. You're saying there's a chance. Yeah, I'm saying there's a very good chance. They also didn't cast, they didn't use the island, so there's the island, I assume. Also, I don't think we've seen force from them. So. No. Cool. Heal one yet, but we didn't die. So that's cool. That's really my favorite thing. Not dying. Yeah. Okay, well, we get five million free mana here. So can we get something we can cast? Wow, Zowie. No, of course not. That would be way too good. <sighs> yeah. Let's talk about frustrating. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. Now we're at the mercy of them. I guess I never thought about that. Friends where it's just like, they have like a large apartment in New York, which would be like, they have to be rich basically. What? 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 Yeah, all these are fine. None of these do anything. They're just a bunch of dirtly dudes. You gotta land. Actually get you. Never. They're coming. Oh, yeah, he going in. Wow, look at this aggression. Lots of mana. You will be dead. Lots of mana. Let's see. What, let's see if we can draw a spell. You guys like spells? Monastery Inventor. That's pretty good. I draw a lot of things that do stuff. I don't like it. Yeah, I don't like it either. Hmm. 
That's a gentleman. I guess they bounce it. Eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Oh my god, they can just vent. Oh, they can't vent, sir. They don't have the mana for that. Yeah, no, they have the deal that's not cool. <laughs> However. Yes? Are we still dead? Uh, I guess it depends on what we draw. I mean, we get the block, don't we? Oh, they just have blue into last as their other fucking card. Cool. That will do it. Seems good. Did seem pretty good there. V Duck Massacre actually seems great against them. <laughs> Take out Lodestone Golem. See you later, Golem. Where are you, Golem? Golem? No, oh, forget it. Feels like an easy one to land, but you really didn't. Who do you think you are? Don't talk to me like that. Why not? I'll kick you out. You'll be on the what? street. I'm not even a lease. <laughs> All right, I'll scratch it out. That's not how it works. <laughs> I know how contract law works, buddy. I'm a lawyer. I seriously doubt this. <laughs> Maybe that's true. Maybe it ain't. What are you gonna do about it? At the moment, nothing. I don't really need to do anything. Damn it! He called my bluff by by what? <laughs> so I just was, to yeah, it was good. See you later. Peace out, my main main. I mean, I didn't notice your pizza guy there before. Yeah, that's my little pizza squish mallet. Wow, that's no attack. Cute. That's fascinating. It's a bold strategy, Ken. I don't think this guy's good with this hand. But neither is not attacking with your haste 1-1 one, one for 1. I agree with that. It's the first I line. think it's just this followed by Shark Typhoon next turn. Full Typhoon? Yeah. Yeah, that seems good. I agree. And then when you massacre all their meat, <laughs> you're going to make a big shark out of the meat. It's true. Big shark. Oh, yeah. Big shark. Huge. I mean, unless they have Red Elemental Blast, which I hope they don't, but maybe they do. Now I wonder if waiting is smart. Yeah. Keep a mana leak? Yeah, I mean, you're not in a lot of pressure. Yeah, you can wait. Or we could just cycle this, make a 4 4. That seems pretty good. Why don't you just suspend the Rifty and pass the Tisty? Sure, bro. You got it. Because I wanted to keep up Mana Leak, but, you know, maybe you're right. Maybe you're smart. I mean, if they tap out, we're just going to go. Oh, boy, I'm really hoping for a meatball. What? I just want to play Meatball Massacre, bro. Oh, you want to black us? <laughs> for meatball, like, what? Come on, give me that big meatball. Meatball! One time. It was a meatball! Best meatball you can draw. Buddy, I'm meatballing out right now. Take a shot every time I say meatball. You'll be drunk. Meatball massacre. Yeah, give me that life. Brutal. Absolutely brutal. Doesn't it do other things after it sticks around uh whenever whenever a creature i control dies they lose a life okay, whenever so a creature like a i constant. control gotcha. when they control dies i gain a life that's a good magic card man <laughs> that's why it's like 60 bucks still oh yeah i'll never buy it oh yeah one two three four five six now we can actually keep up shark typhoon with mana leak that's exciting robert robert Kitty cat, or a bird, or a moth. <laughs> you really narrowed it down. He's the only one. Uh, it was one of the three. I'm going to process video. It's just going to be a stupid card. It's always a stupid freaking card. That's rude. Yeah, attack for two. Look at this. Look at these standard rare six mana enchantments I got in play, bro. It was a car. It was a car. So like, do I play anything? I don't know. Shark him. Get him out. 
Dude, you got to shark them if you got them, you know, my man? I can tell you what not to bounce. This? Yeah. That's what I was going to bounce. It's four more mana. Yeah, but you get a land. And then they tap out that turn. Get, I got multiple counter get spells. get one more land, we lose the game. That's how it works. That's interesting. They can have it. Makes you think, doesn't it? No. <laughs> Guys, I am tired. I'm tired of you. Well, suck it up. Finish. Solid strategy. I think so. Good for you. It's the American dream. Just suck it up. Hmm. Fascinating. Oh, that's a good point. You can mount your own massacre. That's fine. Hmm. I assume they have a counter spell and a kiki jiki. Yeah, that's fine. They're untapping their land. Sure. Sure. Oh, well, that's great for us. Wow, I'm significantly less concerned now that that has happened. At least make us think you got it. You're just giving it away for free. Speak to the Dane of the pre-order. The the Dane of the pre-order? Those don't seem very good right now. Uh, I mean, the Swamp lets us keep up Mystic Confluence. So the I Swamp mean, seems really good right now. Did I, I didn't play land this turn, right? Uh, Jesus, God. <laughs> I don't know. I'm basically drunk. Yeah, you checked your little robot, okay? So you don't know. So you checked your robot? be nothing without your robots um this feels Tin mystic confluency i like drawing cards you know Draw two. And you also get to make a five five which is pretty disgusting right plus they can't just kill us next turn so i'm fine with this keeping a mail leak and drawing two and drawing two cards making a five five flyer and counter spell does life get any better oh i don't no. know don't be ridiculous There's Dr. Chupanista. The Swamp is a man. So he has one solemn and two random cards. Has Tim as okay, a man. So one random card. Fantastic. Well, okay, we won the game. Another trophy. Wow. Trophs McGoofs. Thank you guys for watching. Really appreciate it. Slam the buttons. The like button. The subscribe button. The follow. Whatever you want to do. You pick it. You hit it. You slam it. You do the thing. Thank you guys. Really appreciate it. I'll see you guys later.